Let's make a chart that McKinsey consultants would use in Excel to show survey results in just one minute. We need to link our cells at the bottom to the ones at the top so that we don't have to include the percentage. This is where we can put in our bar chart. Go up to insert symbol and select that large bullet. Click insert and just make sure it's off to the side somewhere and you're going to highlight it and press Control C to copy it. Next, let's start the formula. This is the repeat function. And so follow it exactly as shown. We're using the dash to get started, and then we're going to link to that top percentage. And then we're using the and sign to join that dash with our symbol we selected. So we're gonna control V to paste that in here. Finish that formula, and now drag it down, and here is your chart. You can get rid of the symbol now, we don't need it anymore. And let's go up to view and remove the grid lines. You can turn this into a larger dashboard now that you don't have the grid lines. So notice how dynamic this is. We're just gonna do an example here of making an edit and it'll populate in the bottom. So right click and hide everything at the top. And then you could do something like add light gray or some other background to the top three percentages just to highlight them. Looks good.